Okay guys, so since I had uh, poor management, time management skills during class today, you were unable to see the titration portion of the lab. And so this is my attempt at making a video to demonstrate it. Uh, the first thing that we would do is determine our start point um, for a solution in the burette. And so if you can see here, the meniscus uh, is about at the 9.5 milliliter mark. Um, so I went ahead and wrote down 9.5 milliliters as my starting point. Uh, and the solution inside the burette is 0.1 normal sodium hydroxide. So what I will do is I will add three drops of the phenolphthalein indicator. Uh, this is a base indicator, meaning that once the solution in the beaker becomes basic, so a pH above 7, it will turn a faint pink color, indicating that we have neutralized all of the acidic ions within the beaker. The next step is to s turn on or open the burette so that it slowly adds sodium hydroxide drop by drop. And so I'm going to go ahead and do that. So you can see that it's adding drop by drop and causing a pink color. What I'll do is I'll swirl the jar, which will cause that pink color to go away. So let me shut this off real quick. Get that drop in. Okay. So you can see I swirled it and the pink color went away. So that means that we have not yet neutralized all of the acid uh, in the beaker. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it back on. Okay, so we're still not there. It's getting close though because it's taking longer for the pink color to go away as I swirl it. So I don't know if you'll be able to tell in the video, but there is a faint pink color showing now, and regardless of how long I swirl it for, that faint pink color, as you can see, contrasted against the white background there, stays. So that indicates that we have neutralized all of the acid within that beaker. And so at this point now, we just measure the end point on uh, our burette, which looks to be about 10.25 milliliters. And so we'll write that down as the end point, and from that you should have all the numbers needed to do your calculations.